Hello everyone. This is going to be a quick tutorial on how to indicate a drill on a uh, CNC lathe. Um, so the first step that you want to take is you want to pull your drill to center line. So in order to do that, you're going to have to go to MDI and then just type in a quick little program. You're going to tell it to wrap it to tool number four, offset number four. And once it does that, you want it, you want for it to go to the center line. So now we have G002404 X0. So what it's telling is telling, you know, go to tool number four, pick offset number four, and move to X0, which in this case is center line. So what the machine is gonna do when I press it. You guys are going to see that it's going to, the turret, it's going to index the tool number four and it's going to come to center line. So I'm going to press it one time and you guys can look at the turret right here and see it's indexed to tool number four and now it's going to read the X0. So now it's going to go to center line. So now I'm in position to be able to indicate that drill. I'm going to go ahead and move that drill a little bit back and you guys are going to need an indicator I normally use a uh, 5 tenths indicator and you guys are going to need a swivel arm with a, a magnet base uh, they're made by Noga Noga is a very good manufacturer that they, they make this type of uh, setup uh, it's an arm indicator and you're going to use the base of that magnet to place that onto your spindle when you do turn this on the magnet activates when you turn it off then obviously it doesn't uh, so I'm gonna place that on top of my spindle there and activate the magnet that way it stays there and I'm gonna rotate my spindle to the bottom this machine has a really tight really tight quarters they don't have a lot of room so on this specific machine it works best to start at the bottom on the SL20s uh, for instance like the one that we have at the college you can start anywhere really you know this one I have to start right here and what you're gonna do you're gonna place the tip of the indicator on the flute that is facing you so you're gonna get it close you don't have to touch you just wanna place it to where it's gonna make contact when you use your uh, dial adjustment adjustment so I'm in position there and I don't know if you guys can see the dial right here but right now the dial the needle is at the 15 mark so as I, as I move this knob 